Hey guys, this is Jimmy from Primer is Best. I'm looking at this Chevy truck that came out of Alabama. Well, there's the tag, Alabama. Uh, I found I found this on Facebook Marketplace, and so did Tim Dixon here at Gas Axe Chop Shop. That's where I'm at, Gas Axe Chop Shop. He is on Facebook, Gas Axe Chop Shop. He spelled Axe, A-X-E. Tim was ahead of me on this truck. He'd already found the truck before I did, so Tim... I just jumped out of the whole conversation talking to the guy about the truck because Tim was ahead of me. So Tim bought the truck. It's a custom deluxe. I believe it's been repainted. Kind of a cool old truck. But I was going to buy this and have it hauled to me. I live in East Tennessee. But like I said, Tim got it, and uh, I'm glad he did. It's a nice truck. I wound up buying that 60, 66. Already had these wheels on it. I think they were 20s, well, I'm pretty sure. Let me check just to make sure. They look like Corvette style. I'm trying to see. The 235, 45, 20s, yeah. Corvette style. I, I like the way these look. I'm trying to show you this truck real quick and move on to some more videos I want to do here at Gas X Chop Shop while we are here. And pretty neat old truck, isn't it? AC truck. It's got the typical what I call uh, rust issues, like in a you know a round headlight, square body truck. I don't know where the truck is originally from, or who done the body work, but I mean it's got typical rust issues. You know if you have a square body or have had or have had as many as my friends around me and myself live, we've had a bunch of square bodies in our lifetimes, and you can just about pick it you know go around picking you know cab corners rockers you know right behind here where's my finger behind the rear wheel you know just this that and the other a lot of times the battery tray inner fender typical typical stuff it's nothing if you're friends with tim dixon you know it's nothing to be scared of i mean you, you got to get the rust repaired but i don't know i'd i'm i, I really just love square bodies and you know, having rust, I mean, you're talking 40 years old. 40, 50 years old, I guess. I don't know what year this one is, but... But I just... I just like square bodies. And, I, you know, it's got aftermarket tail lights and stuff. I'm just pointing out things you might not have noticed, but... Got the cargo lamp light for the shines on the bed. I don't know what Tim's plans are with this truck, but... It's always good to come by and see it. I'm glad Tim got it because, uh, you know, that's, that's what friends do. He was interested in it, and he beat me to it anyway. So, But uh, it came from Alabama, and uh, I think the guy that the story I was told, best I can remember, is the guy was uh, fixed it up and drove it some, and then I don't know, he lost interest or something happened. I'm not really sure, and it set for a while. So, that's the story on that. But Tim got it, and I'm glad he did. Had it hauled up here to East Tennessee from Alabama, and uh, I'm glad he. I'm glad it's got a home here at least for now. But like I said, if you're ever interested in anything Tim Dixon has, a gas axe chop shop, you better better call him. His phone number is on his Facebook page. Cause if you're interested in something like this, or, or, or this, I mean, I'm just showing you. You better call because, bam, it's gone. Bam, he's traded it. I mean, that's how quick things go around here. Like I said, I've bought several trucks from Tim over the years. Several. And uh, I bought some from GM Tim 38, too, and his dad, Charlie. We just kind of <laughs> play with them a while and then get tired of them, and then we move them on. So if you ever see anything 
gas axe chop shop that you think you might be interested in don't hesitate to call because they get going you're watching primer this best i appreciate if you'd like and subscribe to the channel you won't miss nothing i want to do some more videos here at gas axe chop shop while i'm here with mrs pib and uh we're just kind of having a good time hanging out with them and i'm enjoying this really hot summer day here doing videos <laughs> but no seriously uh i'm on Facebook Primate is Best, Instagram Primate is Best. Got a second YouTube channel called Man on a Budget, and I'm on Instagram, Man on a Budget 1. If you'd like and subscribe, you won't miss anything. Let me know what you think about this Chevy truck. It's got a good color combo. I don't believe it's original, but it's still it's different. I don't recall ever seeing one this color. It's kind of a gold, gold and white color. Pretty interesting. I, I mean, it wouldn't take much, you know, little work here and there but you'd have a pretty nice little truck it's already nice in my in my eyes patina style hey god bless y'all catch you in the next one like and subscribe i'll see y'all later